who you list with matters. Let me tell you what I mean by that. So when you're choosing if you're gonna list with two different options, there might be a solo agent or there might be a team. And today what I wanna go over is the advantages of listing with a team versus listing with an independent agent. So there's a lot of things that listing with a team can benefit you with. And one of the biggest things I think is the avail availability to technology to be able to push your listing to more places. Let's be honest, as a solo agent, you're maybe selling 12 to 20 houses a year, but as a team, we're doing over 150 transactions per year, which one, gives us more market knowledge, two, gives us more available funds to be able to push that marketing to a further audience because we're using several different people to be able to push that out to a wider audience of people, which ultimately will help your home sell for more money. Another advantage of working with a team is you don't just get one agent working on your behalf. You of course have your listing agent, but then behind them is a whole layer of people. We've got the marketing team, we've got the transaction coordinator, we've got the videographer and the photographer, and we've got all these people who have eyes on your listing and are making sure that no steps get missed and that your listing is presented in the best light possible which is why we're able to sell our listings for 98% of list price, whereas the solo agents in our area are only able to sell them for about 89% of list price. So I think that the advantages of working with a team help you net more money. So the question that I wanna ask you is what's more important to you, the amount you pay for commission or the amount of money that you net in your pocket? And if you're like most people, the amount that you put in your pocket is gonna be the big determining factor in choosing who to list with. So when you're thinking about listing your home, it's really important to make sure that you interview the agents and make sure you understand exactly what they're doing for marketing, exactly what they're doing to get your home to the biggest audience of people so that ultimately they can get you top dollar for your home. If you're thinking about buying or selling and you want some advice or maybe some questions that you should ask your potential agent, feel free to reach out and we would love to get back with you and give you all that information.